Tell your friends if they mess with us, this is what you're gonna get. The House is directed by Andrew J. Cohen and stars Will Ferrell, Amy Poehler, Ryan Simpkins, and Jason Manzukas. When a parent's daughter makes it into an expensive college, they realise they don't have the money to pay for her four-year tuition. So in order to pay for it, they open up an underground casino with their neighbour, and it causes a lot of fun, but also a lot of mayhem. I was actually looking forward to this movie for a couple of reasons. It is a team-up of Will Ferrell and Amy Poehler, which is of course an incredible comedy uh, dynamic, and I also thought the trailer for this was hilarious. This movie is perfectly fine if you want a fun comedy to go and watch with your boyfriend, girlfriend, partner, whatever. This is a pretty good date movie. Will Ferrell and Amy Poehler are both good in this movie, but not great. They have both been better, and this is definitely not their best work. This is really disappointing, as they were building this up to be the next big Will Ferrell movie in the same league as sort of Anchorman. This movie is not even close to Anchorman. But that's not to say Will Ferrell and Amy Poehler were bad in this movie, they weren't remotely bad and they both had some fantastic moments, they just weren't the best they could have been. It is really Jason Manzoukas who carries this movie along. I have always liked this guy as I find him very funny in most roles he takes on, especially when you look at movies like The Dictator that he did with Sasha Baron Cohen. However, even in this movie I felt he was holding back just a little bit. He is still raunchy and as crude as ever, but this was restrained even for him, and that is quite a negative when you think of Jason Manzoukas and his comedy career. Looking back on everything I just said, I feel like I am being too down on the movie. Because like I said at the start, this is a very funny movie, and I really did enjoy myself while watching it. I think it is a very fun film, and it is perfect if you want to go to the cinema and have a good time and laugh. I just felt slightly underwhelmed by the movie as it is set up to be this great Will Ferrell comedy classic, but it fell short of coming under that legacy. I give The House a C.